Hey folks, right, so we're indoors today. Um, this workout, we're gonna use a weight for, ideally a kettlebell if you've got it. I'm gonna use a kettlebell. Um, if you haven't got a kettlebell, a dumbbell. Um, if you haven't got a dumbbell, uh, a couple of litres of water in a bottle will do the same trick. If you haven't got anything like that, then just, um, just do the movement, you'll be fine and uh, you'll still get a good workout of it. Um, same thing with the other workouts, um, just do as many reps as you're comfortable with. If you want a drink, stop, have a drink. If you need a rest, have a rest, that's fine. Just do as much as you can. Um, I've been stuck in doors all day writing programs, so I, I'm gonna go at this a little bit and try and get a sweat on. Um, it doesn't mean you have to rest if you need to, do as much as you can. Right, let's have a go. Okay, right, so same mobility warm up. We're going to go squats, feet just over shoulder width apart, nice and controlled. So I start with this exercise, will be quite difficult, and I'll get lower. More reps I do. Let's try and feel that. A couple more reps. Good, into a straddle loop. So, pressure position, left foot by your left hand. Follow your hands to the ceiling, feel the stretch, drop your hips. Squat side. That's two, we'll do six. That's good, take it to a pressure up on your knees if you like. It's six reps. Hold it at the bottom for a second, all the way back up. Nice and controlled. Squeeze your chest muscles at the top of the movement. Good, on your feet, back to the squats, nice and easy. Nice deep squat. For 10. Torso upright. One more. Good. Back to the straddle loop. The six. Big stretch. Last time round for the mobility stuff. Nice deep squat. For 10. Two. One, good, straddle lunge. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One, good, into pressing for six. You still have turn, grab a drink if you want one. Grab your kettlebell, grab your weight. Excuse me, my next door. Good. Okay, so first exercise. We're gonna go just cleans, okay? Uh, so nice and controlled. Core nice and tight, lower back stays straight. Uh, and then just go with it after that, okay? So, 
from the ground, kettlebell stays in the centre of the line of the body, please catch the kettlebell and down. Catch. Nine more. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. One, good, swap sides, another 10, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one, good, weight down, then steady, okay, we're going to go reverse lunge, so a normal reverse lunge you would do like that, you're stepping back, torso upright, try and keep your balance and like that, what we're going to try and do is stay low, okay, so we're going to start with the knees bent, we're going to do a lunge, we're going to come back, stay low, other side, so your quads don't get a rest, yeah, another 10, 9, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now you can start next exercise. Okay, so we're going to go single leg floor touch. Okay. So we did them in the last workout. You're going to get your balance on one leg. Reach for the floor. Feel the stretch in your hamstring. Come back up. We'll do them all on one leg. Okay, so 10. Slow and control. 9. 8. 7. 6. Five, four, three, two, oops, one, swap legs again, ten, nine, try not to return that other leg to the floor, another six, Five, four, three, two, one. Good. Right. Grab your kettlebell. You got a kettlebell. Kettlebell or dumbbell. Try and get an arm curl. If you haven't got a lot of weight, just exaggerate the movement. It really squeeze your bicep. Yeah. Full arm extension at the bottom. We'll just do ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, go straight to the first exercise, back to the cleans. 10, 9, get a bit of a swing going, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, swap sides, 10, 9, Two, one, good, so we're going to go stay low lunges, hold the kettlebell if you like this time, hold the weight, 
knee slightly bent. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good, weight down. Single leg floor touch, nice and controlled. We don't speed these up. Slow and controlled for 10. Control, tense your biceps, squeeze them. If you haven't got much weight, really exaggerate the squeeze. Another seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Five. Good, straight back to the cleans, let's go. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Swab side. exercise, okay, so kettlebell stays on the centre line of the body, good belt, whatever you're using, okay, and you go from a squat position to a high pull, elbow the highest point, hand of the kettlebell, no higher than your chin, 
Cowbell stays in the middle for 10. Nice deep squat. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good. Swap sides. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good. Weight down. Okay. So if exercise commitments, there's two options. You're either doing little squat jumps like that, or if you can, 10 tuck jumps. Okay? So we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, good, face and floor, single leg, hip through, leg in the air, pull the floor is directly into your knee, hide you down the top, pull the extension of the hips, back down again for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, one, swap sides, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, one. Good stuff. Okay, so from a seated position, if you've got a kettlebell, you're going overhead extension. Like that. Okay, if you haven't got a weight, if you do it today, you might want to do a tricep dip. Like that, just on the floor, just trying to get a bend in your elbow. We're going kettlebell over. Let's go. Right down your back. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Good. Kettlebell down. On your feet. Back to the squat and high row. Let's go. Now rest. Let's go. 10, 3, 2, 1, swap sides, 10, 9, make sure that lower back is staying straight, 8, Three, two, one, kettlebell down. Tuck jumps if you can. Let's go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good. Hip thrust. For ten. Three. Two. One. Swirl legs. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, 
four, three, two, one. Good. Back to the arm extensions. Let's go. Ten. Nine. Right back down your back arm, straight at the top. Go to six. Five. Four. Three. Two, one, good, down, 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 on your feet, now rest, straight back to it, squat and high pulls, go, ten, now we go, come on, nine, eight, seven, Eight, nine, 
Ten, if your weight's too heavy and it's the only option you've got, you can always do it double handed like that, yeah? For the side, if not, let's go. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven, nice and straight. Six. Five. Four, keep going. Three. Two. One, good. Dumbbell down, kettlebell down. Okay, so, we're going to pipe the push up next. This is your shoulder muscles. So it looks like a bad press up or a mine up press up. Okay, your bum's in the air. Okay, forehead towards the floor, up again. Shoulders working hard in your chest. Let's go for nine, eight, seven, six, five. Four, knees if you have to. Three, two, one. Good. Flatten your back. Okay, right, so, thank you, crunch. So, you can start with your arms and your legs in the air. You have to be able to push your lower back into the floor. If you feel that lifting at all. You can't keep your belly button pushed into your spine. And you need to shorten the movement, okay? So, arms up like that. Try to go right to the floor and up. Yeah? For ten. Nine. Squeeze your abs. Eight. Just hold it there. Okay, so our next one, we're going to do a crunch. At the top, we're going to lift the shoulder blades up for seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. One, good. Back to the first exercise, which was, oh, glute bridge, sorry, you're back. Glute bridge, chest press, bottom up. Let's go for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, bottom up, 4. Three, two, one, good, other side, keep it going, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, good, kettlebell down, shoulder pressing, Using an opportunity to stretch your hamstrings if you can as well. Let's stay straight. Shoulder press, drive it up. For 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Swap side. For 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, good, kettlebell down, pike push up, bottom in the air, forward to the ground, go for 10, Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, thank you, crunch, burn your back. If you're up to it, you can use your kettlebell for the crunch. Use your dumbbell, same thing. Let's go, just for ten. Control, nine, lower back into the floor, out to tight. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good. Get well down. Bottom up. Last time. Chest press. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven, 
six, five, four, three, two, swap it over. Elbow down every time. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Kettlebell down. Shoulder press. Keep it going. Ten. Swap side. Again. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Good. Now bell down. Five pressures. Last time. Ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Thank you, Grinch, again. Take control. Ten. Nine. Eight. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Good. Come on down. You think? So we got three more exercises left. Nine sets. Let's keep it going. Try and leave the rest out. Kettlebell up, dumbbell up. You don't need to use it. Body weight will be enough with this. We're going goblin squat, low as we can. And up. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three, two, one, good. Kettlebell down. Single arm row. So we go left foot hand through. Kettlebell right hand. Dumbbell right hand. Elbow high. Try not to move your shoulders at all. For two, three. Good, drop side. Two, one, good, cowbell down, back to the floor. Okay, so this time, we're going to push ups again. Put your index finger together. As you do the push up, it's coming over with your sternum and with your breastbone. Okay, so you can do it on your knees if you like. Okay, so the body on my knees, elbows out to the side, keeping them tight into your body. For 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good, on your feet. Six sets left, and we're done. Let's go. Goblin squat. Six, 
three, two, one, kettlebell down, single arm row, ten solid, still listening to me okay so we go calf stretch hand down the middle of your back pull your arm back triceps at the same time good effort at the side guys if you're watching these and you're doing these workouts please let us know because um, not everybody puts a note that they've done it we'd like to know that they're getting used good single leg hamstring the side. Good. Of course, I'm only doing the basic stretches with you now. If you were going to do some developmental stretches, this would be the ideal time to do it. All the muscles, all the ligaments nice and supple. For the side. Well done, folks. Keep it going. 